You know how, um, like, if you put enough girls together long enough, their menstrual cycle syncs up? Yes. Our stomach just growled in unison. We are that... Tell, tell me about the struggle. The struggle is real, Yakima. Today it has come in at the right time because it's growing and we want to thank the people that have been responding and checking out oh, Mr. Yeah. Riggs' uh, you know, posts and enjoying our video because in our struggle today, <laughs> <gasps> this guy said, hey, Babe Joel, ready to get yak? Yes! Yeah, and, and thanks for all the, all the suggestions too from all the great places in Yakima. We're gonna hit them all up eventually. It might take a while. That's okay by me. But you did mention something today, bro. You said time honored tradition. <laughs> he said time honored. Can I bring that up? <laughs> yes, bro. Yes. Because I'm not from here. And I want to get as acclimated as possible, not just with the food, right. but with the culture and with the city. We have a place called Burger Ranch. They have a full menu, a little bit of everything. And it's just, uh, it is a time honored tradition to check out Burger Ranch. So we're going to go there right now. About. You're gonna like it, I promise. Uh, <laughs> you know what's funny? Growing up, uh, the commercials is, I think, what made it. There was a local. There were there were two local celebrities, as far as I was concerned, growing up in Yakima. There was Dave Edel, yes, and there was Bob Klim. Now Bob Klim isn't with us anymore, but he was the spokesman for Burger Ranch and other local businesses. And when you saw Bob Klim in a Burger Ranch commercial, you knew it was making something special. Was there like a jingle too? It was like a little like had like a kind of classic, you know, country guitar, bow dow dow, and go. Burger Ranch, and then it would, he would go on the Burger Ranch escapades of doing something. I don't know. Let's that's, just go. I'm, I'm hungry. We're going inside. And eat. That's why it's a time honored tradition. It is. It reminds me of the old commercial. I got to find them on YouTube or something. See if I can find. All them. right, baby Joel. They have a little bit of everything, from cheeseburgers to corn dogs to burritos to ranch burgers to breakfast. The breakfast is phenomenal. Yes. Sandwiches, combos. Oh, I see. The shakes fresh are awesome, lemonade, bro. Fresh yes. They have fresh. fresh what? We kept those lemons and squeezed them ourselves. This is, the it's the real deal here, my friend. Fresh lemonade, bro. Okay, they had, you had me at time-honored tradition. That's right. And I said they that's had right. me at fresh lemonade. She squeezes them herself with those so biceps. This young lady over here said it's done from scratch. That's right. This is not that commercial crap that you get at the supermarket. <laughs> no, this is the real stuff. I'm telling you, time-honored tradition. They have it on the menu. Bag of fries. I saw that. I was like, how big is this bag of fries? It bro? is it is literally a bag of fries. <laughs> when you see this thing, you'll be amazed. Bag of fries. I'm telling you. Hey, I'm with it. They just brought the orange creamsicle shake that they do here. It's a seasonal thing. This for summer, and then they do a fresh uh, candy cane shake uh, during the winter time. Well, using actual crushed ground. They do it all themselves here. Candy cane. Oh, so good. They gave us two straws too. I don't know if they're like, like they think we're on a date, maybe? I mean, it's very, we'll the... it's very romantic, <laughs> but I mean, you know, hey. They did hook me up though with the fresh strawberry lemonade. Oh yeah, how was that? You know what? I've never had the strawberry This lemonade. strawberry lemonade is muy delicioso. Oh, look at you. Yeah, you know what? We do have, you know, some uh, Spanish speaking listeners. Mm -hmm. So for our, you know, Latino audience. Mm -hmm. So good. Yeah. So good. It's so good. Once it hits the lips, oh it's so good. I'm telling this is actually going to be a two stager. We didn't say this yet. Yep. It's a two parter. We're having breakfast here and then we're getting lunch to go. Yeah, man. No. This is not a pancake. This is a <laughs> That's the special. You can get that every day for less than four bucks. All that. Oh, no, no, no. This is a man cake. A man cake. Does that make sense? Can I say that? <laughs> that didn't get weird, did it? No, I think it'll be all right. Okay, okay. About halfway done or so. Verdict so far. Now, although the place is called Burger Ranch, again, don't let the name fool you. Their breakfast, top notch. I agree. <laughs> I'm rocking the French toast over here. I'm such a French toast fanatic. They do it perfect here. Every time, consistent. I'll even share this bite with you. Here you go, ready? Ow. I just had a man cake. A man cake. A man cake. Right. Scrambled eggs and real bacon. Not that processed stuff that you get in the supermarket. That's right. And rigs. Yeah. This is only part one. This is, this, is, this, is, this is a part one of two. It's on the menu. Bag of fries. Go ahead and crack that sucker open. It is literally a bag full of french fries. Oh, and the fry sauce. You didn't have any fry sauce yet. That's another staple here. What? So it's a special concoction. That they have. It is a special concoction. 
and we'll, 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 we'll cover that here pretty soon. But yeah, literally, bag of fries. This is one of the reasons you come to Burger Ranch. Bag of fries. Round two. Are you ready? Oh. Oh my God. Yeah. Whoa. Yes. Whoa. Hold it up. Let's see. Show it to the rest of the class. Now this. That's a burger. Yeah, this is a proper size burger. None of this oh. slider looking thing that you get at most other places that they call a cheeseburger. This is the real. Oh. It's heavy. The weight behind it. Ooh. Oh. Now I got I got the uh, the bacon double. Uh, that is the big ranch burger, and that's why it's called a big ranch burger for a reason, man. Just the sound of. <laughs> I don't think fry sauce was invented by Burger Ranch, but Burger Ranch certainly perfected it. This is, as far as I, as as far as I'm concerned, and I, you'll probably agree, this is the staple fry sauce. You're not gonna find better fry sauce anywhere else than Burger Ranch, and I want you to give it a shot here. We have our bag of fries. You can see how giant this bag of French fries is. A tower. You gotta go to uh, you go to you go to Burger Ranch. You get the bag of fries. That's how that's how easy that is. Uh, give it a shot there. However you want to do it, two at a time. Perfect. Mmm. Mmm. Fry sauce. Yeah, a little something extra, a little something. Hey, I might actually dip my burger in this too. I know people who do. <laughs> burger Ranch, you're the bomb. He's right. Your, your verdict on Burger Ranch? Getting me acclimated? Zang. <laughs> Zang, I'll take it. 